When it comes to choosing the right school, student athletes look at academic programs, sports facilities, talk to the coaches, and get a feel for the program overall. For Kim and Morgan Metro, those were all important factors, but nothing mattered more to them than each other. We were a package deal, so everywhere we looked at, we just asked to come together, and that was the main criteria for us. At first glance, many think the Swiss-born golfers are twins. They're both seniors, they're both straight-A students, they like the same things, and they act in similar ways. But Kim is actually two years older than Morgan, and waited a year so she could attend school at the same time as her sister. Like everything else in their lives, they were going to play together at Florida State. We've always done everything together. We've played the piano, both of us together. We did horse riding together. Everything we've done, we've done together. With golf too, it made us really closer just because we're doing the same thing. And we can help each other out here and whenever we need something. We both knew, know each other really well. We had our backs and we knew whenever we had something going on, we could talk to the other one. And we didn't have this transition where we we're really alone. The Metro sisters are among the strongest members of the FSU women's golf team, combining for 20 top 10 finishes and three All-ACC honors over their four years at Florida State. And Morgan has won three tournaments in the last two years. Both girls are also accomplished members of the Switzerland national golf team, a team they've been a part of since they were teenagers. And at every step of their careers, the sisters have constantly pushed each other to be better. They are competitive with each other, and as anybody would, um, and they just really have found a way to be sisters, best friends, competitors, teammates, and they've done it really, really well. Kim and Morgan's good-natured sibling rivalry isn't only beneficial to the sisters. Their competitiveness and drive to succeed rubs off on their teammates as well. The sisters are leaders on the team, inspiring their teammates to play at their best. But even though the two are extremely similar, they lead in very different ways. We do have kind of the same mentality. We've had the same upbringing, sort of, and so we, most of the time, we do things the same way. I mean, sometimes we're pretty different, too. Kim is very much a determined player. She gets the job done on the golf course. But at the same time, she's also our vocal leader. I think that the younger players on the team definitely look up to Kim and Morgan. They're great role models, like I said, with their work ethic and just how hard they practice out here. Kim and Morgan may be leaders on the team, but to them, this team is more like a family and a home away from home. You come out here, you see your teammates working and, and you're just having fun together and just, yeah, just having that atmosphere in the team and then just in general in school is just really special. Since freshman year, we've gradually gotten closer and closer, which I have loved. Our team is so close. I would call each and every one of them, especially the sisters, my sister. But as the Metro sisters inch closer to graduation and the end of their careers at Florida State, they're excited about their futures, but will miss the school and the team they love. But we're all very, very close. We all always hang out together. Every time we get a chance, we do stuff all together. So it's really nice. It's going to be hard to leave them in a couple weeks. Like, I have mixed feelings. Half of me is like, I'm really excited for what's next. But half of me is like, yeah, I'm going to miss this place. After they graduate, Kim and Morgan plan on moving to Orlando. Together, of course. It's pretty cool to know that we were going to start together and then end it together, for sure. No matter where their future takes them, one thing is certain. Kim and Morgan Metro will always have each other. I'm Jacob Russo for Seminole Sports Magazine.